two, two, two day, I want to talk about some major XDC news that ties in XRP and XLM once again, as we have seen multiple times. And it includes it in a very interesting way, especially with ISO 222 uh, going live in November of 2023. So the DTCC, which is the Depository Trust and Clearing Corporation. I think I got that right. I have checked it like five times and I forget it every time. But they acquired currency. currency. Um, this ties in with XDC in a lot of ways and it ties into XRP and XLM as well. But a currency is embedded in the UAE, which is a part of BRICS for tokenized securities that can be utilized on XLM and XRP. Now, here is the actual article here. Uh, DTCC looks to unlock the power of institutional D D DeFi by acquiring a currency. Here is the actual article. Um, there's not a ton of information, but uh, it is uh, it is an important acquisition that will provide us technology to drive market-wide transformation by enabling end-to-end -end digital life cycle processing for tokenized assets, d d digital currencies, and other financial instruments. Um, there also is a comment down here that BlackRock CEO called the tokenization of securities the next generation for our markets as well. Um, so that's an interesting thing to tie in because of the uh, Bitcoin ETF pending approvals that should possibly happen by January 10th of 2024. But let's look a little bit more at how the D DTCC ties into XDC, XRP, and XLM. As we have shown in the past, here is a D DTCC up here. Uh, it can interact with Chainlink uh, and other ERC20 tokens. You have EVM compatibility and uh, the XDC hybrid chain, which connects into Corda, and then you have a direct connection into Swift as well, which then goes into SBI R3 and SBI, which is XRP. And that essentially just unlocks everything else. And that is shown by R3 again, being uh, connected not only to XDC, but XLM, XRP, and Ethereum as well. I haven't really found any great direct um, connections to Algorand, but uh, I am primarily concentrating on XDC, XRP, and on XLM as well. Now to expand upon that, here is uh, R3 and its direct c connection into the D DTCC as well. That connects into Swift uh, through um, the Swift GPI pr pr program. And as we can see again, that is uh, shown here in a bit more d d d detail, the connections to SBI and XRP. Um, and then you have uh, the ISO uh, 222 uh, connection through Impel as well on the XDC network, tying into the Zinfin hybrid chain, and the XDC network uh, ties into Trade Funex as well, which is looking to um, essentially tokenize a lot of the trade finance industry that is worth probably conservatively about 30 trillion. Um, so obviously that's a very large number there. Then you have uh, R3 tied into the Bank of International Settlements and a lot of direct connections to multiple 
CBDC projects as well, which uh, at least I think two of these involve XDC and XRP in one way or another, which I have more information on those and uh, I will br br break those down in much more de detail as well. Uh, this is just a little bit more on um, R3 core to XDC and SBI. I think it's pretty much the same information, but um, it just includes a few more company connections and uh, not terribly useful for this content here. But let's get back to the DTCC itself. What is it? It is the backbone of the entire f f financial system. It provides c c clearing services, settlement and assets services, wealth management, repository and der 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 derivatives, which we know that uh, Ripple and XRP are um, a part of the uh, International Derivatives Something Association, the IDTA or ITDA or s s something. Then you have uh, in information and data and institutional trade processing as well. Um, I guess I can p play this too. <laughs> DTCC plays a pivotal role in protecting and transforming the global markets. For nearly 50 years, we've created solutions, pioneered new technologies, and modernized systems to transform the post-trade ecosystem. We serve a community of more than 6,000 financial institutions around the world, solving the industry's most complex operational challenges. Our unmatched suite of services, including the world's most robust clearance and settlement system, and the largest trade repository for the global derivatives market, can unlock your firm's potential and propel the markets forward. Institutional Trade Processing offers a straight-through processing solution for buy-side, sell-side, and custodian firms. Clearing services reduce risk and costs across the U.S. equities and fixed income markets. Settlement and asset services securely process over a million transactions every day and provide custody and asset servicing for securities in over 170 countries and territories. Wealth management services delivers processing and information services for mutual funds, insurance, and alternative investment products. Repository and derivative services satisfies reporting and compliance obligations through locally registered trade repositories. And DTCC's data services powers your investment strategies across asset classes, simplifying the complexities of data management. As new technologies and regulations continue to transform the industry, DTCC is engaging with our clients to advance the financial markets, delivering innovative solutions that create efficiencies while reducing risk and costs. Get ready for the post-trade platform. Okay, that right there actually reminded me. Um, I thought that uh, Securency was on this map as well, yeah. So um, they have already been directly associated with XDC as well. So it's essentially one major XDC partner acquiring another major XDC par partner. So this whole XDC uh, trade ecosystem just continues to uh, not only expand, but to concentrate more and more on the... Uh, advantages that the that XDC and uh, the platforms that use XDC pr pr provide so that was this one uh, that was just kind of another announcement from the DTCC itself but here's where we get even more interesting all DTCC settles through fed wire um, that is breaking or broken down here the uh, depository trust company and the national securities C clearing corporation uh, this breaks down how the uh, DTCC is actually tied into fed wire and how that has its own connections into the fed now system as well so and as far as the ISO 222 stuff goes, uh, we also have this um, that the DTCC 
DLT based upgrade is uh, going live in 2023, which um, that will be the upgrade of the trade information warehouse for der derivatives. And we have already shown that uh, the DTCC and a currency are um, involved with der derivatives as well, which that value of that part of the f f f financial economy is trillions of dollars. So here we go again. Uh, the D DTCC will convert its ISO 222 corporate action messaging to the Swift SR 2023 version on November 19th of 2023. A lot of other um, migrations and upgrades for ISO 222 are happening on that day as well. So with everything happening with XRP, with XLM, and with XDC, and with the uh, lawsuit being nearly completely over for Ripple and XRP now, it is really interesting how all of these things are lining up to almost coincide with the ISO 222 uh, requirements in November of 2023. And with all of the other things happening in the world right now, in particular how they affect the uh, economy, it's I just find it, again, very, very interesting that all of these things are appearing to be uh, not, not only happening, but they are happening quicker. So also remember that XLM is a partner of a currency with very large players like Wisdom Tree and I can't say STs right now, so uh uh. The DTCC, who settles 2.4 quadrillion worth of securities per year, has now bought a currency. Here you, you can clearly see how XLM is involved. Now, this was a really interesting uh, graphic that I haven't seen before, but remember, remember, re remember, DTCC is but one piece of this p p puzzle. Um, and he is connecting that by reminding us that uh, the DTCC uh, s settles everything through Fed wire which over the inter ledger protocol connects to xrp and um that connects into everything else that we t t t talk about here it connects into hyper ledger r3 corda ethereum uh dtcc here again i mean it's 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 just over and over again at this point that XRP, XLM, and XDC are so intertwined, and they don't always have it, but they do tend to have uh, at least relatively close price action as well. Now, here is another uh, point that the DTCC and XRP uh, settle 2.3 quadrillion. And here it is on this graphic, uh, 2.3 quadrillion. And with the uh, interledger protocol, um, uh, it, it is pretty much another direct connection. So besides Swift, which is quite possibly the largest payment operator, there are also other players as well, such as DTCC, Ripple, and many others. So once again, we just show over and over again how XDC is so massively connected that until I really began to check into this over the last month or so, I was not aware of how powerful XDC actually is. And every day I get more and more confident, not only in XDC, but in XRP, and XLM as well.